back to my skin locker. My name is Ira and today's video as the name says it all is all about beauty heroes. So this month beauty heroes discovery features a brand called Henne Organics. Uh, it's a pretty new brand to me. I haven't tried anything from the brand as yet. So it's the first time that I'm trying anything from this particular brand. So the box comes with the oil, a lip mask and a lip balm so I haven't tried the lip products as yet because I have a lot of lip products which I need to go through before I open these two but I've been trying out this uh, oil uh, from past a week and yeah if you are interested in knowing my thoughts about this particular oil then keep on watching so i got my box around 12th or 13th of this month and i've been using this particular oil every night since then and i'm loving the way it is you know getting along with my skin the oil comes beautifully packaged in this beautiful box which speaks luxury in itself it, packaging is not to mention it's very beautiful right from the box to its bottle just look how beautifully well packaged and sleek it is and the twist top mechanism which i absolutely absolutely love the only issue is that you really have to be very careful with the top right here if you want to squeeze out that perfect amount onto your palms of your hand otherwise like it just did it's going to just splash everything whatever is there in the pipette right onto your palms and you'll be left with a little more product than you actually need for your face neck and chest so that's the only issue i have with the packaging uh, right here otherwise it's a beautiful oil that works absolutely wonders for my skin during my nighttime skincare routine as of now as for the ingredients needless to say it has loaded with beautiful ingredients which i would put somewhere on the screen the it has a very herbally kind of scent which might not be very you know appealing to some but i personally do not have any problems or issues with this particular scent because the scent just fades away after a few minutes and i really don't have any issues with the scent at all uh, but the consistency is on a thicker side like it has a slightly thicker consistency for the kind of oils that i prefer these days so that's the reason i use this oil generally at night because i do not mind my face looking like a glazed donut during night but during the day it is slightly on the thicker side of spectrum which i am not into uh these days as the summers are approaching so it's a beautiful oil my skin is absolutely loving it during the night like i just told you it takes a little time to sink into the skin because of its you know consistency but it leaves a very soft satin kind of finish on the skin which i absolutely love had it been in the earlier winter discoveries this would have been my absolute go-to morning facial oil and i would have enjoyed using it you know during my morning routines a lot more it's a beautiful oil you can beautifully lay it over your ahas retinoids retinols and you know and i've been loving this product i would like to request beauty heroes to look through their discoveries more closely please because i believe they were a little too off with the sahajan discovery last year as well because had it been in the cooler months the sahajan box the cream and the serum would have been much more useful to us rather than you know putting them off for a couple of months and then using them during the winter months same is this with this particular oil had it been in the winter boxes this would have been an absolute hit among a whole lot of people um, irrespective of skin types dry skin people would love it during any time of the day but People like me who have oily congested acne prone skin cannot use this product during the daytime because it's like I'm telling again and again it's little on the heavier side 
and my skin does not jive with it that well because the climate that I'm living in does not you know respond very well to such kind of oils right now had it been like I'm saying again again during any winter months I would have totally absolutely fallen in love with this particular oil head over heels and I believe this would have been the only product that I would have used in my morning or the evening skincare routine but nevertheless I'm enjoying it during my nighttime skincare routine and I absolutely absolutely love it as for their lip products I told you I haven't opened either of these two but Henne Organics as far as I know are known for their lip products uh, so these I don't think so would be a disappointment for, for me so I'm holding on these two because I have a lot of lip products to go through and I really do not want to you know just open them up right now so I'm just holding on these two and loving the oil right now now let me just briefly go through my nighttime skincare routine featuring the last uh, month's uh, beauty heroes box which had these two beautiful products the lehalani cleansing oil and their aqua a retinoid renewing serum i've been using these products ever since i got that box uh, last month and i have pretty definite opinions on them right now so yeah let's just quickly go through the routine so during the nights the first cleanse is always like an oil or a balm cleanser that i use the cleanser that i'm using right now is this one from the brand like i just told you lehalani it is this tropical enzyme cleansing oil uh, this is an enzymatic cleansing oil as the name states and as you can see i haven't used quite a lot of this product now just don't take this one as just another oil cleanser the stuff here is potent the ingredients here do work very beautifully well on exfoliating the skin so i highly suggest that you know you start slow with this cleanser go with like every other day instead of going blindly like day in and day out uh, i suggest that you start slow with this particular cleansing oil because like I'm saying again and again, this stuff really does work on the exfoliation part of the skin very, very well. I use this product like three to four times a week, depending on like how my skin is feeling on that particular day. Uh, like I told you in the past also, it has this very sweet citrus kind of scent, which I absolutely like. So as per Leilani, you're supposed to take a dime size of this product on your clean dry hands and use it on your dry skin and then uh, dip your hands in warm water massage your skin uh, a bit and then rinse it off with water i do not like using it that way i go generous with it i take four pumps of this particular oil cleanser give my skin a good massage for a minute or two leave it on for a good two three minutes to you know get that enzymes working on my skin and then I rinse this product off from my skin it rinses off completely clean there's no traces of oiliness on my skin it leaves my skin feeling very smooth soft and you know very cushiony kind it, it gives a very cushiony kind of feel to my skin so I really love this oil cleanser so whenever I'm using this particular cleansing oil i make sure that i follow up with a very mild second cleanser because i do not want to aggravate my skin with another you know exfoliating or a salicylic acid based cleanser in the second round as well so i follow up with a very mild cleanser and the one that i'm using right now is this one from aminu it is their b free cream cleanser this is like i've talked about this cleanser a Brazilian times on my channel uh, it's a very beautiful basic cream cleanser that works wonders on my skin this is probably the I'm really really running low on this cleanser like hardly few users left it has a very beautiful scent love it to the core I really do not want to talk more about it because I've talked so much about the mean cleansers like 
I'm a broken record about them. So this is the cleanser that I follow up after using this cleansing oil. There are a few other cleansers that I'm testing out, the green cleansers that I'm testing out with this cleanser, but I'll talk about those cleansers in another video, which is like popping out in my mind right now. So I don't want to talk about them right now. Whenever I use an exfoliating cleanser of that kind or an exfoliating product, I make sure to use a very hydrating toner uh, in my skincare routine because I use that toner after every skincare step like I always say. So the one that I'm absolutely loving right now is this one from Joaquina Botanica. It is their hydrating essence and as you can see I'm like almost going out of it it's like almost right here really love this essence it has a very fine mist beautiful scent does the job perfectly it does not interfere with any kind of products that you lay on top of it it, it refreshes your skin instantly so i go ahead with this toner and then i go uh, grab my eye oil and the one that I'm using right now is this one from the brand Votary. It is their retinoid and tuberose eye oil. I absolutely love this thing uh, and it's very rare for me to talk about an eye product because I generally do not use a lot of eye care you know eye serums or eye care creams and all that but this oil is an exception it's so beautiful it comes with this roller ball and all i do is go like twice with this on under my eyes and then pat it and the oil just sinks it into your skin beautifully there are no traces of anything you know underneath your eyes there's no greasiness no nothing this thing just vanishes away from your skin in a moment. So I'm really, really loving this eye oil from the brand Votary. After I'm done uh, patting this thing on my eyes and eyelids, I again spritz my face with this toner essence and then I go on with my beloved uh, retinoid renewing serum. Now this is the product that I use thrice a week, no more than that. It's not that my skin could not take it more than, uh, you know, three times a week, but it's just that I have a very specific skincare, nighttime skincare routine, and this one just fits in three times in a week. So I love it during those three days. I've been using it like non-stop ever since i laid my hands on it uh now they say it's a retinoid renewing a serum but it's basically an oil which spreads onto the skin beautifully sinks into the skin equally well and you know it leaves that very sheeny kind of look on the skin for a few seconds but as you massage this product onto your skin and give it a few minutes to you know your skin to absorb this product in this thing goes into your skin like nothing else and it, it, it really does helps with the active acne issues on my skin I believe uh, not I believe I know like I know it really helps with the active acne on my skin the next day when I wake up with this product on on my skin I believe the active acne that I have the redness on those acne is not as aggressive it has really subsided and it really helps to heal the acne at a much faster rate than on days when I'm not using something like this in my routine so it's a very beautiful oil based serum that's out there and if you believe that botanical skincare does not work you really need to try out this product right here this is the product that i absolutely absolutely highly recommend if you want to try anything from leilani go for this aqua a retinoid serum it's a beautiful beautiful product the only issue is the packaging the pump here this like once you pump it like uh, i take two pumps of this particular product spread it all across my face neck and chest beautifully the issue is like 
when you pump this thing once it does it beautifully well but when you do it like twice uh, at the same time the product just you know it, it just spits out the product and it it's all over the place it's on the mirrors like on the desk and everywhere so that's the issue that i have with this packaging Lelani, if you ever see this video please do something about the packaging uh, of this particular product but otherwise it's such a beautiful product it's so not like i have no words to explain how beautifully well it is doing with my skin uh it's non-irritating i've had no issues with it whatsoever all i do is layer it with a beautiful cream or a balm product and my skin feels so very soft nourished pampered and like i just told you well rested the next day there is visible brightness in my skin my acne's the active acne's look less what, what do you call them less uh, aggressive uh, there is a lot less redness on my skin and I'm absolutely loving this stuff right here very herbally kind of scent very light herbal kind of scent which won't bother even the most sensitive noses in my opinion um, the formula is not at all greasy like i just told you it sinks into the skin beautifully me being acne prone congested oily skin type can deal with this stuff beautifully so people with dry dehydrated or any other skin type would love this product in their routines highly recommend and absolutely love this thing from the brand this is something that I would definitely be purchased once I run out of this particular serum right here. I layer either the Lehlani Bless Balm on top of this retinoid serum. This is a beautiful product from the brand once again. It has such a beautiful neroli scent which I absolutely enjoy and all you need is a very teeny tiny amount of this product rub it between your palms warm it up a little bit and pat it into your skin do not go heavy handed with this balm and you know just use it like a normal uh cream otherwise it would leave that very greasy sheen on your skin that very greasy heavy feel on the skin so i would suggest that you take a very teeny tiny amount of this product warm it up between your palms press it onto your skin and just leave it like that for a few minutes and this thing would just your skin would just drink this thing up i love the scent love what this thing does to my skin the combination of these two products works beautifully well you know to give me that well rested skin that i'm talking about again and again so i really really do love it and stop smelling this thing it has such a beautiful neroli scent which i absolutely love i use this balm for multiple reasons i use it like a hand cream i use it on my cuticles i use it on my dry elbows i use it as a lip balm i use it like i just told you as an all over skin balm i love this thing it's a beautiful beautiful product from the brand lehlani and yeah i really really do love it so that's it for the bless balm but ever since that i got my henne box i've been pairing this lehlani serum with this beautiful oil and the combination of these two products is a match made in heaven it's so luxurious it's so beautiful like it it's beyond like I cannot explain how my skin feels with the combination of these two products here. It takes care of my redness, my acne, my skin imperfections and it takes care of my, you know, that dullness, dehydration and that uh, moisture that my skin carves for uh, time and again. So the combination of these two products work wonders on my skin and I've been having great results with these two products as my nighttime skincare routine. So I love this product. Like I just told you, I layer it with my this retinoid serum. I layer this product over my tretinoin and I layer this product over the AHA products that I use on days when I'm not using this something like this or my tretinoin 
cream so this is like that multitasker which is working with all the actives that I'm using in my nighttime skincare routine this is the product that is going on top of that and has been giving me very good results if you haven't tried out this particular oil then I highly suggest that you subscribe to Beauty Heroes box get this one from them at a very discounted rates and you won't be disappointed this is such a beautiful beautiful oil especially if you are dry dehydrated mature skin types you love this product during the day as well but for people like me who are acne prone congested oily skinned this is such a beautiful oil for us during night time especially during these hot humid summer months that are coming ahead I can definitely see myself repurchasing this particular oil once I run out of it which is very rare of me because I have huge collection of facial oils. This would have been like I just told you in the beginning would have been such a beautiful oil for me had it been in the winter discoveries from Beauty Heroes. So that's the only issue that I have from the beauty heroes this time but the product itself is beautiful and i'm truly truly loving this stuff right here it's like a truly beautiful a beautiful product out there and worth every penny that they are asking for it love it love it love it and the last step in my skincare routine for the night is a lip balm and the one that I am focusing on finishing up right now these days is the one from the brand belief and this is such a beautiful beautiful lip mask like I'm really running low on this one if my camera can ever show you I'm really running low on this one it's a very beautiful lip mask it is one of those lip masks that stays put on your lips the entire night and you wake up with that you know soft feeling lips the next day so yeah that's pretty much for my nighttime routine and this beauty heroes box this month so if you're interested in knowing anything more about any of the products that I've gone through in this video please do let me know in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can if you like this video then do like share and subscribe it really does help me to you know roll out the content more often for you guys and I'll see you all in my next video till then take care have a good day and bye bye